Hello, this is Dr. Indam Burwa. I'm a surgical oncologist. As we all know that this, uh, cancers are increasing all over the world. And uh, in India, we have seen a change of the demographic, I mean, change of the patterns of cancer. And uh, we have seen that this rectal cancer has increased quite a lot. And uh, in contrast to the population in the Western countries, where we get rectal cancer only beyond 50 years, here in India we get patients who are as young as 20 years and most of the patients are actually in between 20 to 50 years of age. So uh, the worst part about rectal cancer is that this, uh, if the cancer is in the lower one third of the rectum, which is very close to the anal canal, then we need to remove the anal canal. If the patient loses the anal canal, the patient needs to have a permanent colostomy throughout the life where the stool will be collected in a bag outside the abdomen and uh, this uh, uh, with whenever we tell the patients that uh, we need to uh, you need to undergo this kind of surgery they actually usually are very reluctant and can uh, they undergo only with a lot of counseling and all and some people uh, some patients in fact never turn up for the surgery because of uh, such a uh, huge morbidity that this surgery can use. Now this uh, intersphincter resection, this surgery actually uh, saves the patients from all the misery of uh, having a permanent colostomy where the patient does not need to uh, have an appliance fitted outside uh, the abdomen to collect the stool. So the patient after an ISR can lead a normal healthy life and can pass stool as a normal human being so this is a boon this is a new technique and this technique is actually uh, can be performed much better in, in a robotic setup because uh, see with open and laparoscopic it's not so technical feasible because in open uh, it's not possible to see uh, so deep in the pelvis and again in laparoscopy the laparoscopic instruments are quite rigid so it's very hard for the laparoscopic instruments to reach because of the curvature of the pelvis um, but it's quite easy for the robot because uh, we have got a lot of degrees of freedom where uh, the robotic arms can actually uh, can uh, can move like our hands and wrist so this uh, this becomes very much oncologically safe and better in uh, what in a robot yesterday we did a intersphincter resection of the rectum for um, carcinoma of the lower third of the rectum and the patient is doing quite well now he is ambulating i mean uh, he is moving around now and uh, he is in fact uh, uh, doing quite well and he's uh, we have been allowed to him to have uh, food the best part is that there is no pain at all and he is completely pain free this uh, robotic procedures are actually associated with very less amount of pain and uh, this is one of the very i mean most advantageous part of the robotic surgery